columbica. And the most sure way to know that you have an out of columbica from their nest is that they're the only ones that have an out uh, outside trash mound. Okay. So you want to dig a nice little hole right next to the colony. You can get a nice straight up and down wall where it is. So. And then you just extract the fungus from the side? Extract the fungus from the side. Okay. And add a cephalo So this is a part you just got to be kind of careful yeah. to not destroy the whole fungus yeah. garden. I want to make sure that I'm like the bottom of my hole is lower than the bottom of the chamber. So I get the whole garden out. Oh yeah, I see it now. Yeah. That's great. Please don't collapse. Nice. Yeah. Wow, that's beautiful. Isn't that great? All right, and then the holy grail is finding the queen. And the colony this small, she's usually just right on top of this one chamber, so it shouldn't be too hard. But let's see. You saw her or not? Not yet. some space and then coming see the queen yeah I see your big old butt Oh, whoa, yep. she's huge. She's huge. Oh my God. Cool. Success.
compared to digging up leaf cutting at nests in Texas. Mm -hmm. And in Texas, they're often like a meter or more deep on the ground. Oh wow. First time I dug up one of these guys, it was like, holy crap, it took 20 minutes. Mm -hmm. It's a different kind of leaf cutter over there? Uh, yep. Same genus, different species. Any more tunnels in yours? I don't know yet. I haven't checked it out. Hold on one second. Oh, this is beautiful. 